cotton, another one of our staple fabrics. Been around since the year dot. Really lovely to work with, behaves itself, doesn't slip and slide around. When you press it, it you know, lays flat. Really lovely. The only thing I would say, if you're making garments out of it, make sure that you wash it first. Pre-shrink it. And in fact, to be perfectly honest, whatever you're making out of it, if it's going near the washing machine when you've finished, pre-wash the fabric. It would take you two secs, just dunk it, dry it, and then cut it out. Um, you can make dresses, you can use this for soft furnishing. If you, if you want to cover a cushion and it's just the colour you want to use, but you're thinking it hasn't got enough body, because it is quite thin, beautiful texture this, it's got a lovely smooth feel to it. If you want to make a cushion and this hasn't got enough body, then use two layers of it. Use the two layers together and you'll find that it will give you that oomph on the front of your cushion. If you're using it for applique, if you're putting a design on it, again, support your fabric. So put another layer of cotton behind it. When you apply your design and sew that on, it won't pucker up round the edges. So use cotton, but multi-layer it and you'll get a firmer finish. When you're making clothes, obviously, most of the time you, you have single layers. You might want to do a double bodice. Um, I make things for my granddaughter, I make double bodices because they're comfortable to wear. But when you're making clothes, as I said, single layers are great. And this will gather up beautifully because it's really nice and soft as well. So um, just have a go and experiment, combine different colours. Really, really lovely fibre to work with.